Okay, in this tutorial we're going to be doing the log on screen. Okay, so you as uh, you do the splash screen, you do the label for your log on. We've got our text boxes for our username and password. So if I show you adding the password part, you can see it gives a text element on the left. That's to label text box. So we've got password and you can format it as normal if you know how to do that. So I won't show you how to do that. We've got to make sure that these unbound boxes are named. This one would need to be named username. So if I click on all, hopefully you can see the property sheet. If you can't see it, all right, it's on the form design. You've got property sheet. Okay, so up here, click on the box and label it username. This one, we'll label it password. Once you've done that, you need to add in your button. Okay, and that's where the VB code is behind it. You'll have a pop up and just click cancel the pop up. Pop -up. At that point, we need to change the name of the button. So it is a log on or login, whichever you want to call it. And we change the name of it and the caption. Once we've done that, you can click on event and you should see a triple dot on the right hand side. That will press it and it will uh, have a pop up and it's the code builder that you want. You can see I've done the exit button. It's very simple. It's just a message box with goodbye. And then um, it's got the command to quit. Now we are doing the log on. Okay. So what we need to do for the log on, we have, so if username, if you remember, we did that uh, text box as username. So if inside the user types the words instructor Lewis 21, and then in the password, text box they put the pork chops then the the command is to open the form main menu now if you look it's in speech marks and if I go back to my table and I show you my form is actually spelt it's got the main with a capital M menu with a capital M no spaces so when I've done the code that is exactly the same. Okay, so you want it to open, it has to be spelt exactly the same. And then if it's not the same, then you want else, message box, and then you put your error message in there. Okay, so anything that you want as a, um, a text, put in these speech marks, look where it says message box, and that will become your text. Okay. So we've got if username equals instructor Lewis 21 and the password is hashtag pork chops at, then it will open the form main menu. Else there will be an error message, the message box, your username or password is incorrect. Please try again. And it would be a VB critical error. Okay, so if we close that, and if I close my text box, right, that code should now work. And if I go to my um if you go to form view look and you press log on, that will come up with the error message now because it's incorrect. And if I now press the exit database, that will say goodbye and it will shut down the actual database. Okay, so that is your VB.